Coming up, we're going to break down a chat GPT app that is making over $200,000 a month. Stay tuned. What is up, App Nation? It is Steve P. Young, founder of AppMasters.com. We are the app marketing agency and YouTube channel that's going to really help you grow your downloads and revenues in the fastest and cheapest way possible. But today, we're going to take a look at a chat GPT app that is making over $200,000 and how you might be able to ride this wave. Here's the app. It is called Genie. It does rank number one for chat GPT. Now, if you haven't used chat GPT yet, go use it. It is definitely the future. We've had clients who've used chat GPT to optimize their app description and seen great results with just that alone. So if you're looking for what words to use in your ad copy, in your screenshots, in your YouTube description, it is phenomenal technology and definitely the future. So copywriters, be careful. It might just ruin your industry. But here's the app, Genie. It's developed by App Nation. And I'm using App Magic Rocks, App Magic Rocks. They're not a sponsor or anything, but I do like their tool a lot. Now, if you look at App Magic, you can go down here. You can see the screenshots over here. You can see similar apps. You can see the revenue per download all time. I think that's a very important metric because it gives you a measurement of how much you can afford to pay per download. So if you're just breaking even, then it's just about a dollar per download. And you can see it was released on December 8th. So take the revenues with a grain of salt. But I do think that the app is doing well. It just recently released. And then if we looked at Sensor Tower too, so Sensor Tower has changed. It has been, it had been, I should say, my go-to source for all these metrics. But Genie right here is making 300,000 according to Sensor Tower. And then the closest competitor is this one, which is not available in the US right now. I don't know what's happening, but they're making over 500,000 according to App Magic. And then we can take a quick peek at how much they might be making at Sensor Tower. So if you're trying to find this data in Sensor Tower, you're going to have to go to App Profile, App Intelligence, App Profiles and Category Rankings, and just sort, search for the app. And this other app, ChatGPT app, is making $100,000 according to Sensor Tower, whereas App Magic makes about 500,000. Now, look, anything above six figures, I know the numbers are different, but anything above six figures, it gives you an indication of the opportunity that exists. So if I see six figures a month, I'm there, right? That's enough for me to give a tell, despite the differences in what the tools might be saying. Now, the thing I wanna highlight here is I pulled all the keywords that Genie ranks for, and you can see they rank a lot for these terms, ChatGPT, but there's a lot of terms that are have pretty decent traffic here. And so you can see GBT has 31, OpenAI is 38. Now OpenAI could be like image, AI images too. So be careful with that. But anything around the chat GBT area has pretty decent search traffic. And you can see that's where I would say the bulk of their revenues are coming from. One thing I want to show you guys is I'm, I am comparing the two different chat GBT apps right now. And you can see when they launch and when their category rankings so this Genie app is, so Genie is a red one. So it's been launched a little bit earlier. As you can see the category rankings. The other chat GPT app is taking over. And then now something happened that it's not available in the US anymore. And then now Genie is starting to really take over. And then if you click into view app profile, you go into Genie right now, and then you can see when they launched, so December 8th, you can see their top in-app purchases right here. And then... It looks like they might be advertising on some ad networks, but we're not sure. So Sensor Tower says new. And then if we look into here. So I just like to use various tools just to get a sense if you're thinking about creating a chat GPT app too. What Sensor Tower has is the top in app purchases. So you can see as you're figuring out your own pricing, this is the wrong one. As you're figuring out the pricing, you can see that the weekly pricing is performing the best for them. $12.99, $8.99, $6.99. And we'll take a look at the app right now. All right, here's the Genie app, just launching it. It's the first time user experience. I've played around with the app a little bit, but I wanted to give you guys the first time user experience. Your AI assistant, chat with the world's most advanced AI on your mobile phone, ask questions to get mind-blowing answers, 
Very cool. Help us grow. Show your love by giving us a review on the App Store. I really like this. I think this is one of the best practices that I've been talking about. Like you wanna get people to review your app during the first time user experience. It does work, all right? Enable, I think I already reviewed it. That's why I like this enable. Here's what I don't understand. And you know, like I know with an app like this, they have some costs for usage too. So they have to do it like this, but this makes it a little bit more difficult for as an end user for me to figure out like, hey, which one should I pick, right? Unlimited questions, higher word count, but they don't even tell me what the word count is right here. So that's kind of annoying. And then if we switch back to the top in-app purchases, we see that the advanced weekly, the $12.99 per week right here, is the highest, so it has a three-day trial. It looks like all of them come with the three-day trial here. Let's see, oh, maybe they don't. Let's click on something. So their second most popular is this 899 Pro. Yeah, it doesn't come in. So imagining the Vance has the highest revenue, their number one in-app purchase is because of this three-day trial as well. And one thing to note is that with weekly offers, usually a three-day trial is the norm. And we've seen good results with that. Okay, so I'm going to skip here. And I'll just show you guys the power of ChatGPT if you haven't done it. You can ask a question right here, explain. So here, this is great, right? Like write a tweet about global warming. Or you can say write a headline or tagline for a meditation app, right? You can go. Find your inner peace with our meditation app. There you go, right? If you're not satisfied, you can say, try again. Find your inner peace with our meditation <laughs> app. All right, that's what I've been finding about this particular app. So save, All right? Let's try it one more time here. Write a tweet. Let's try this about global warming. Climate change is real and it's happening now. We must take action to reduce our carbon footprint right, and protect our planet for future generations. Global warming act on climate. YouTube descriptions. Now, you can even do that. So write a product or app that works to description about a meditation app that has five minutes. So you can go that that fancy. Let's see what it, what, the, what the results say. Introducing the perfect meditation app for busy people. Our five-minute meditation meditations app offers quick and easy guided meditations that can fit into even the busiest of schedules. With a variety of topics to choose from, you can find the perfect meditation to fit your needs. Whether you're looking for a quick break from stress, a way to relax and unwind, or a way to focus and increase productivity, our 5-Minute Meditations app has something for everyone. With our easy-to-use interface and helpful guidance, you can find the perfect meditation to fit your needs in just 5 minutes. Download our app today and start your journey to a more mindful and relaxed life. See the power of this? You can hit copy and then add it into your app store description. That is the power of ChatGPT. Now, from a monetization standpoint, I'm going to hit save here. I love that they have the Try Genie 3 Days app for free. Now, you can see why. I don't know why it doesn't automatically go to this payment plan, the advanced weekly one, but you can see why that one's converting the best because they're saying that for free. None of the other ones really have a three-day trial. And given the fact, now, I always say having a trial is always better, but given the fact there's cost per usage, they do not have a trial, and I think that's fine. Okay, because you have to make do what's best for your business from a cost revenue perspective and just having a trial may kill you in terms of being like, ah, that user just canceled because it's not going to be 100 percent canceled their trial and cost me, I don't know, ten dollars, whatever it is. Right. And one of the things I really love to do with every app that I audit is take a look at the second open. So. I'm opening it for the second time. And as you can see, they're hitting me with the paywall. This is one of the best practices. Jake Moore from Superwall said this, and I love it. The more paywall views you get, the more money you're going to make. So definitely have more paywall views. All right. That is it. Let me see this rate. Yes. Yeah, they have this rate us thing here. Let's go back into the app. I like that they have more apps here too. So you can see that. It's a great way of doing it because 
you know, it's cross promotion, right? And one of the things I want to highlight here as I'm talking about these more apps feature. So one of games do this very well. And I got this tip from Aurora from Fun Run. But she said, look, when we were launching a new version of Fun Run, we had in-app messaging, a big pop-up in our current game to cross-promote the other apps. So once you have one app like Genie that takes off, well, that becomes a great source for any new app you have as well. And don't forget that particular point. All right, guys, that's it. I know it's trendy right now, and that's why I wanted to create this video. So be careful. What I would say is be careful if you're going to create a chat GPT app because the industry and everybody's talking about it it's going to get super competitive very shortly but i do think i have a strategy in mind to help you with your app launch and that is in our app masters academy that you can check out by going to appmastersacademy.com if you sign up you will get a free bonus one hour consult with me all right so that is a free bonus for anyone that signs up for the app masters academy and if you want help with your app downloads and revenues and grow it in the fastest and cheapest way possible, go check out appmasters.com. You want to hire us as an agency. By the way, if you like this video, make sure you hit that like button and leave a comment. What kind of videos you want me to create next? If you have any questions, really want to focus in on answering a lot of your questions, whether it's on Instagram or TikTok. So go follow me there. It is at Steve P. Young on Instagram and TikTok. All right, until next time, I'll see you on the next video.